on Muscle Hill, who uh, I'm pretty confident that he can do it. Um, so he was a two-year-old champion. How how much did you guys talk about this over the winter? Any? Um, we yeah, we talked about it. Like, oh, Muscle how's Muscle Hill doing? We'd always be asking questions about how's he doing because we knew he had a big year ahead. Because once he won the uh, the Peter Houghton, everyone was saying, oh, he's favored for this and that. So uh, now that we're in the Hamiltonian, it's like coming true. And how's it been so far uh, on the lead-up? Is your dad staying pretty calm and collected? He's actually pretty calm and normal. Uh, he's excited, and it's been a little different with all the news crews and whatnot. Like, today, uh, NBC came to our house, and they wanted to videotape us and everything. So, but how he's acting has been, he's just been regular. He's excited, he's been sick, but he has been making a couple few more calls. Yeah, he's on the phone a lot. Yeah. So have you, I know you, you guys were there when he won the Breeders' Crown. Have you thought about that moment, you know, about if he crosses the wire and, and wins, what that's going to be like? If he crosses the wire and wins, it will just be great. Because uh, I know ever since that Peter House, my dad's been so excited to this day. So uh, he, it would just be wonderful. That's like, good. So what else do you like to do in, in your life? Uh, what kind of music do you like? Uh, I like really any type of And, and sports? Sports, I love baseball. That is my favorite sport. Uh, what's your favorite baseball team? Phillies. The what? Phillies. The Phillies. Oh, you're in Yankee country. My, but, uh, uh, well, you, you, hold on. Well, my <laughs> second favorite team is definitely Yankees. Ah, well, we're trying to get some... Uh, I'm a some Philly Yankees fan, but if they play each other, I don't know who I'd root for. Oh, no? No, nope, I don't think I'd root for the Phillies or the Yankees. I'd root for them both because... Right now, they are equals to each other. Okay. I like them both. I get it. I get it. So, is there anything you'd like to say to your dad about this whole experience? Like, you know, I know he's, I'm sure he's a, a great dad and paying attention to you, but he's a tad distracted by Muscle Hill. So, anything you'd like to say to him about that? Um, well, just keep up the good work, but maybe you could try to make it a little more time. Oh, well, but you're very proud of him, too. Yeah, right? I'm very proud of you, Dad. I think you're doing well, like you're not kind of bragging like, oh, my horse is in the Hamiltonian, you know, we're proud, we're definitely going to win. He's not like saying we're definitely going to win. Anyone he talks to, even my family, he says, we got a chance. Right. He won't say, I know we're going to win or anything. He'll just say, I'm confident and whatnot. Mm -hmm. And he's never like, oh, and he's just always good. Yeah, well, your dad's a horseman and he knows it's never over till it's over. Yeah. But it's been a great ride, huh? Yeah, so he said like anything can happen. Like, he might be the favorite, like, for a year now, and he still is, but that doesn't mean anything right now. Oh that just means he has more of a chance, but anything can happen. Is there any horse you're you're afraid of in the race, or you think is the major competition? Uh, I agreed with my dad that our major competition is definitely explosive matter. Because, uh, and so far, in uh, the Breeders' Crown and uh, the Eliminate, and uh, in the Breeders' Crown, Peter House, we've noticed that he's been yeah, very close. Second place in both. He's, he's definitely catching up to us. All right. Well, good luck, and I hope the next time I'm doing this, we're in the Ambletonian Winter Circle. Thank you. <laughs>